Well, hello, my friends. It is um, the Friday before the end of the year. Uh, I hope everybody had a wonderful uh, holiday week here, whether uh, you celebrate uh, Hanukkah, Christmas, Kwanzaa, whatever, uh, Saturnalia. Uh, you know, I just hope everybody's having a good um, end to the year. So this is a quick video. Uh, I want to show off uh, two very cool gifts that were given to me by one of my dearest friends. Uh, they were a surprise. Uh, we, uh, I wasn't feeling well, and we had a small Christmas at my house. So uh, uh, there, were, there were six of us, four, four people came over. Uh, and, uh, my friends, uh, Kevin and David, uh, who are like family to me, uh, and uh, Aaron and Paul. Uh, so, uh, they came over for dinner, and uh, Kevin surprised me. I mean, you know, we've been friends for more than 20 years, and he knows. I bought him, uh, I actually uh, bought him one of these, uh, Dream Time Micro, I think it is. Uh, Tesla Model 3 um, models, um, because he has one. In fact, he has one in this color, uh, so, uh, you know, he, he, he uh, and I got them the cyber truck from X car toys. And, you know, so every now and then I drop a little die cast on them. Uh, uh, David actually gave me quite a few of my big, uh, die cast cars, the, the 118th scale stuff, uh, like Edsel's and, and, uh, and the Buick Riviera and the Chrysler 300 and just some beautiful pieces, uh, an old Ford Ranchero. Uh, but, uh, so this was very cool, and, uh, the first one is from 2018, let me back this camera out a little, sorry, and it's, uh, from 2018, and it's the commemorative, uh, Hot Wheels Tesla greetings from space, the first car to orbit the sun, uh, when, uh, Eli shot his own personal Tesla Roadster out, uh, into the solar system, so, uh, and again, because this is a very special car with special packaging, I'm not, this is one of those rare pieces that I am not going to take out of the package. So this, um, this is very nicely done. It looks like it has the, part of the windshield is the lens headlights. It's got nicely tampoed taillights and Tesla badging there. Uh, but for the rest of it, it's fairly simple. But that is very cool um, because my friend, my friend Kevin is is a real car nut. But especially, he loves his Tesla. He loves new technology. So that's very cool. And I always say he loves Tesla and new technology. But uh, Kevin also uh, has owned uh, several Studebakers. Uh, he believe he currently still has the Silverhawk, uh, but he also had a Lark. Uh, he had a couple of 54 Pontiacs. Yeah, he's a real renaissance man when it comes to odd cars. And uh, so then there was this one also, which was a real surprise. So this one, I don't, I don't know, is that a treasure hunt? Uh, I've had cars from this Hot Wheels Classics collection, and I've sent them on to friends, too. This is a Studebaker Avanti. Uh, it's got special pasting, uh, paint, uh, metal body, metal chassis, um... And in 1963, Studebaker Avanti. And David used to have a 63 Studebaker in a beautiful greenish gold. Um, and uh, that was a sweet car. And this is really nice. So this is a 2008 series. Where is it? 2008 right there. Um, collect all 30 Hot Wheels classics today. Uh, I'm going to see if I've seen any of these recently. Torpedo. So there's the list. You can uh, pause and read that if you want. Now, this is another one that's special. And normally I would say I'm not going to take this out of the package. But I know that Circle Flame means treasure hunt in later years. Does that mean this is a treasure hunt? Uh, could this be a super treasure hunt? It doesn't say real riders, but I swear I see 
tread on those rear tires and actually the front tires but they sort of look like red lines so this thing uh and i don't know where they got them uh i i know they have a friend who owns a small antique shop uh but i i don't know um so i know uh i'm tempted to open this one up but i'm not going to today if anybody can clue me in onto what that means um in the comments down below maybe if it's if it's not something that's insanely valuable maybe i'll open it up um but that that's sort of why i have the the dream time micro and of course you know all these other cool open cars here um i saw uh, mike over at diecast looney just did a great challenge uh the um cannonball run the Burt Reynolds movie based on the Brock Yates cannonball race from uh, coast to coast. Um, go on over and check out his video. Uh, and uh, I will see you guys in the new year. Have a great day. Have a happy new year. You guys be well and I will talk to you in 2023. Bye-bye.